This is a quick note on FASM. Uh, some people are getting this error, uh, file not found, and it's pointing to this win32ax.inc. And so just real quick, let's look at it. Okay, so here is my FASM um, directory right here. And of course, we're running the FASM W or FASM windows.exe. And first of all, you need to make sure that it is extracted. When you download the zip file, if you try to run it out of there, you'll definitely get that error. I was able to duplicate that. But now this one is uh, uncompressed, unzipped. And so now, first of all, that file is right here in this include library uh, folder. Okay, so in here, here is that file, win32ax.inc. Okay, so we are not seeing that file. For some reason. And again, if this is all zipped, then the zip, uh, you know, you can run files out of a zipped folder, but it won't be able to see other ones. Okay. And so now, oh, uh, well, let me go back to it. Okay. So here is that file right here. Now, right up here is the path to that file. If I click right here, see that file, uh, see that path, I'm going to copy it right there. Okay. Now let's go back. Uh, the first time you uh, run this, it will create this phasmw.ini file. And in that file, it points to where that the location of that file is. Okay, so see, I copied it. I'm going to paste it. So uh, what I pasted, so you, you can see what I pasted matches up with that. So anyway, so check your INI file and make sure that this include directory right here matches the path to where that is at. Um, so anyway, uh, hopefully this helps and or at least helps you understand what the error means.